So my name's uh, Joe Jennett, I'm the overseer for the West Group and CHB and we are standing on the stop bank where the breach was for the Waipawa River. So we've been here for nearly three months now. Uh, we had initially three contractors on site to uh, stem the breach. Uh, originally we had uh, CHB earth movers, uh, Justin Neville's crew came down uh, with a couple of moxies and diggers and then we also had Phoenix they were one of the first on the scene when we found we just needed that extra bit more grunt to really stem it off we got an uh, HES uh, earth movers which are the local contractors around here as well to uh, help us out all the soil you can see here has all been scraped up uh, off the existing land and then all the metal we're standing on has actually come from about half a k downstream um, from Walker Road where we uh, use the opportunity to do some engineering work on the river and redirect a new channel into the Port of White Power so it doesn't block into the Tuki too, too uh, severely and yeah so we've, I think we've pulled out around 50,000 cubes with the metal just, just for this thing. This side here is almost done, it's just in topsoil and ready for the grass and then it will be the bank will be done and there will just be a bit of land sculpturing to try and get internal drains out properly. But we have uh, breaches downstream, uh, we lost the tip of a stop bank that's been repaired in grass seed. Uh, two sites in Waipawa, uh, in Coronation Park and behind uh, Stevenson's uh, Transport. They've both been repaired and hydro seeded, so they're looking really good. We have done a spur bank, a small bank on the Munga Nook. That was done by Tikitino contractors. Uh, that's come up really good. Uh, Barron's did all the work behind uh, uh, Waipara Township. And now we're currently at two other sites. We've got uh, Tikitino contractors at uh, Stableford's, which is just downstream from us. And then we've also got uh, HES, which are uh, on Tapari Road. And they moved in there last week. So there is a priority list, and we, we're, we're getting through it now. So. We're on to probably the last of the real priority sites, which is uh, the one at the Pari Road. And then uh, it's just the, the small scale marks that are just getting cleaned out. The initial uh, uh, response, we're out here doing 12 to 16 day, hour days, just trying to fight against the river. Um, and these guys since then have been doing at least 12, 10 to 12 day, hour days every day. And yeah, no, the crews worked hard, you know, you can't, can't say nothing.